Hello Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm reviewing a set of darts that were sent to me from Carl at A180 Darts and these are the Bulls NL as in Netherlands Dirk van Dijvenborde. Now I don't know if I've said his name right or not. I practiced it a few times and it just came, kept coming out as Dijvenborde so I don't know I'm not going to attempt it anymore but you know who's darts they are. And if you Wondering about the aubergine connection, if you don't know, Dirk is an aubergine farmer, so that's why the darts are in the purple colour, and that's why it says aubergineus on the pack. Now, Carl at A180 has got a stock of these in, in the purple titanium and also the silver, and he's not selling them on the website so if you want a set you either have to visit the shop or contact Carl I'll put the details up in the description uh, the shop is in St Helens uh, you can contact Carl through Facebook or Twitter and if you mention that you follow me Darren Watson Darts Review Channel you will get free postage and packaging now he said he's going to be getting a lot more in stock this week so I'm pretty sure He's going to be well stocked up on them, so you should be able to get a set. And these ones retail for £60, and I think the silver plain tungsten ones are £45. And like I said, I'll put all the information in the description so you can properly check it. So, let's check them out. So I'm reviewing the 23 gram version, the 90% tungsten and they have the purple titanium coating on. You can also get them in 25 grams in steel tip and 20 grams in soft tip and they retail for £60. So the darts come in this slim cardboard pack and you've got the little plastic section showing you the contents. Inside there's a hard plastic case and they come with the Orbit Genius. Uh, standard shape I think it's the small standard flights and the darts are fitted into a point protector and they come with the bulls medium nylon stems so the darts fit with a black coated point and it's a tapered barrel style wider at the front and then a, a gentle taper as it gets thinner towards the rear you've got a tapered nose and the grip it's got two main sections of grip which is the ring grip sections but the whole barrel is covered in a, a phantom grip or micro grip um, I think bulls call it phantom grip but most people would call it micro grip but there you go so there's grip the full length of the barrel to some extent but obviously these two sections front and towards the rear is where it's most grippy here's a quick close look at the ring grip it's kind of flattish around the middle and the front and the rear it's mixed in with the rings and grooves so just a little bit more grippy on those sections and the coating itself it says it's purple titanium but it probably looks a little more blue through the camera I think it really depends how the light hits it sometimes it looks more purple and sometimes it has a bluey color but I think it's just down to the way these titanium PVD cones work. So, to the naked eye, I think it looks more purple than blue. But there you go. And in the middle, you've got the Bulls logo. And at the end of the barrel, you've got the Arbor Genius etched in. So, quite a nice little dart. And there's the Bulls nylon medium stems and the Orbigenius small standard flights the darts fit with a black coat at 30mm point there's a small section at the front of 2.4mm which is just the phantom grip then you've got the rings and grooves with the phantom grip overlaid on top that's 16.2mm around the middle it's just a flat section of phantom grip of 12.5mm all that front half has got the purple titanium coating on the rear it mirrors the front section but without the coating that's 16.2mm and then you've got a small section on the end of 3.4mm 
millimeters. Length is 50.7 millimeters, width is 6.9 millimeters. Twenty three point one four grams, twenty three point one four grams again, and twenty three point one three grams. Full setup, twenty five point zero six grams. With nothing attached, the balance is towards the front and with the supplied setup it moves just a little bit beyond the center point and this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights it's only a low medium to medium level grip overall so I'd probably say 5.5 at best It's got the kind of a shape that I often prefer, the wider at the front and thinner on the rear just because I'm a front gripper but um, I think I could probably do a little bit more grip on the front. I'm not feeling the grip as much as I was expecting. Gee, my ankle clicking then. <laughs> um, there's a little bit of grippiness from the um, micro style grip, but personally, I think I could do with a little bit more. But probably fine for most people. Um, obviously, it's wider at that front, so as I'm moving up to the middle, it's a little bit thinner and just a little bit less grippy around, around the middle because it hasn't got no rings there. Just the flattish kind of micro style grip. And that purple titanium cotton, it definitely seems to change from a kind of a, a blue to a purpley colour depending on the light, I think, and the angle that the light kind of hits it. But I think that's just down to where the titanium PVD cottons work. They're often like that. Can't remember, was that three from the middle or not? Well, if it wasn't, you've got an extra one. <laughs> Made sure I got that one in. But again, if you're a front, middle or rear gripper, I think it'll be fine, but um, front and rear grippers, it's a little bit more grippy. So if you don't mind gripping, around the middle with less grip then you'll probably be happy with it but again it's whether you like a front weighted style of barrel I mean this isn't excessively front weighted though so it should work well for a lot of people I would imagine And it gets a little bit thinner again on the rear, but <laughs> for rear grippers it should still work fine. There you go.
Yeah, well, let's check out the ratings. If you're into your purple, you might give it more, but I prefer green. So looks 7.5. Grip, not as grippy as I was expecting. 5.5 overall. Weight match, nearly perfect, so 9.5. Quality, machine was very good, but the coat was just a little patchy, so 8.5. Value, 6.5. So, there you go. That's the Bulls Dirk Van Aubergenius. That's... Uh, I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right. I'll give it one more go. I've forgotten it now. Diving Border. No, I forget it. <laughs> well, I tried. So, if you like a front tapered style of barrel, then I think it should work well for front, middle, or rear grippers. Uh, balance seems to be nicest just a little bit front of centre and it fits in the fingers nice and comfortable there. Not as grippy as I probably prefer myself, but probably enough grip for a lot of people. And obviously that middle section is a little bit less grippy because there's no rings on there. But if you want to set from A180 darts, get in touch with Carl or visit the shop. And if you order by the phone or by Facebook or Twitter or whatever. Just mention my name and you can get uh, free postage and packaging. So I'll leave you with the gallery. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. I'll see you on the next one. Happy darting.